Thank you for watching the following PrepTicket.com video. National correspondent Mike Rigg is in a tiny town in Georgia telling us about a record-setting running back. Twin City, Georgia. This small town in East Georgia is home to one high school called Emanuel County Institute and one stoplight. But you see, the two don't really go together because ECI running back Wayshawn Ely never gets stopped. In fact, he puts up ridiculous stats and crazy numbers. Well, Sean Ely is a living contrast in numbers. He plays in a town of just 1,500 people where there are zero fast food joints and the one aforementioned stoplight. But while those numbers are humble, the ones he put up on the football field during his junior season were simply unbelievable. He had uh, around 260 carries for 2,982 yards, which is uh, uh, you can do the math, that's, that's almost 11 yards of carry. 58 touchdowns, rushing touchdowns, which uh, shattered the state record. This is Washon Ely, a statistical freak. He rushed for twice as many yards as there are people in Twin City. This is my house. And as for the 58 touchdowns, well, that's almost as many people as there are in his graduating class. Uh, he could play tag in a phone booth and never be it. They can't get a hand on him, you know. And uh, he's hard enough to tackle if you square him up. But no wrong tackle, he's going to work. During the game, I don't even think about scoring. I just think about how I many points put on the board, I have more than the other team. Ely's touchdown numbers are just ridiculous. And at no point last season was that any more apparent than the night he scored seven touchdowns in just one half. It was raining that night, and uh, the defense, they weren't, they, was, they weren't playing out there playing sluggish. So every time they score, I had to score. Defense, they shut down sometimes, so I scored, and they, they weren't that good, so, like, most of the time when I touched the ball, I touched it, like, 13 times, and I scored a city. He was one touchdown away from breaking the state single, single game touchdown record. 